Hey Bougie Babes, welcome or welcome back. If you don't know who I am, my name is Reese, and this is my beauty channel where we come to slay, especially on a budget. And if you're new, don't forget to hit that red button down below and turn on your post notifications. As you can tell, I'm rocking this super cute highlighted wig. This hair is brought to you by Uni's Hair Company. So if you're interested in how I styled this unit and more information about this unit, then definitely keep on watching. Bye. Lacey, do you think you overdid it with our hair? Uh-uh. Nope. I sure don't. Because we're going to Beverly Hills. Now, if I'm going to do good at that audition, we got to look like stars. One thing Eunice is going to do is spoil your girl, okay? I ended up getting a brush, a wig bag, as well as a robe. And I got some wig caps and elastic bands with some eyelashes and a little brush. This unit is a 13 by 4 transparent lace frontal unit. She is the honey blonde highlighted water wave texture with adjustable straps and combs. And yes, the elastic band came with it. She is gorgeous and I love the color. So we are going to bleach this unit. I'm taking 50 volume developer, quick blue powder, and a drop of rich adore eggplant color a lot of people have been asking why do i do this it's just to um hi not highlight the wig but you know tone the wig that purple is going to tone that wig really really good so i add a few drops of that dye up in there and then as you can see i'm taking some hairspray and just going to comb those little flyaways back so we can avoid over bleaching i love this color because you can still bleach it um some of the knots are still a little bit dark so i left this sitting on for about 30 minutes and i washed it out with some tea tree shampoo it is by paul Mitchell. As well as after washing that out, I took some Shimmer Lights um, Purple Conditioner. As you can see, this isn't a generic brand because it's a little cheaper to do that. And then after it airs dries, this is the next day, and I go ahead and pluck this unit. Um, it didn't need too, too much plucking. It was actually a very easy wig to customize. And I actually really like this texture because we didn't have to style it at all, you guys. All I had to do was just pluck this unit and then apply this on my head. So y'all, it's been a while since I installed a unit. It's been almost two months since I've installed a unit. So I was kind of scared that I didn't have it in me. But, you know, your girl was able to lay this wig for the gods. So I'm actually happy. I still did my same um, install method. And I used the second cap to hold my hair because my hair is actually silk pressed still so i didn't feel like braiding up my hair i was like you know let's just keep this silk press under my head and just use the extra cap to hold my hair in and then use the second cap for the ball cap method and i'm just using some powder foundation um that i got from the beauty supply and as well as i put foundation on the um wig as well so don't forget that you guys and then now we're going to cut off the ear tabs. You already know what it is. I did want to let you guys know and to give you an update while you watch me install this unit. I felt like I lost a little bit of passion with doing wig tutorials, but recently I started back doing Reese wigs. If you don't know, I have a wig care line and I do sell refurbished wigs from companies that send me wigs and I sell them at like a very discounted rate. And just doing that kind of brought the spark back in um, me adding these, um, doing these wig tutorials. And I just realized I have a really good talent and this is my craft and I don't want to completely get rid of this just yet. I'm just really good at hairstyles and just, it just is an art form for me. So I am going to continue doing these um, wig reviews and just, I'm trying to actually start another wig hair business on the side, but I'm going to take my time with it. So I just appreciate you guys still supporting me with all my different transitions and my opinions and just, I don't know. I just can't keep up with, I always feel differently each and every day. And I appreciate you guys just continuing to support my decisions. I might say one thing and then the next week I'm like, okay, never mind, Just kidding. So yes, I appreciate the support. And I will have a updated Chit Chat Life update coming soon right after this video. So definitely stay tuned for that. But enough about my little rant. I do want to talk about more about this wig. I've been getting a lot of compliments. I think high, like light brown highlighted wigs just really goes with me and like my skin tone and just, I don't know, my face. Because every time I have this type of 
um, color on my head. I get so many compliments. It's just giving Beyonce. So I see this wig as more of like a vacation hairstyle, to be honest. I feel like if I went on vacation, I would have my braids and then put this over my braids and take a few pictures with that too, just to switch it up. This is a great vacation hairstyle. I know spring break is coming up, so this is something that you could wear. And it's very easy to style. You don't have to, you know, curl it up or um, straighten it every time. You can just literally, like literally I brush it and comb through it every other day because the hair just is gorgeous when it's in its messy state and it's flowy state so yeah i actually really like this hair style and this hair texture and it blends really really good into my skin and i do highly suggest bleaching the knots because it does look a little bit more natural with the knots bleached and yeah that's basically it i really like this unit and how it looks on me i'm still wearing it to this day <laughs> so i don't want to take it off but i do have to take it off to try other hairstyles but i highly recommend if you want like a low maintenance wig um in your you know bucket of wigs <laughs> and yeah and definitely comment down below how what tutorials you would like to see from me when it comes to hair videos um or any more like descriptive hair videos i know a lot of you uh, watch my videos over and over to learn and you've actually been getting really good at installing these units so i'm actually happy that these videos are working and helping and if you ever need any help just comment it down below and i can definitely make a video geared towards that question um right now i've just been doing a lot of just watch me install videos but if you do need like a detailed detailed video let me know okay girl and as you can see i'm still doing my same exact um wig install as i did last year it just works for me and with this mousse i did this is kind of new for me is adding the mousse to my baby hairs this actually makes the baby hairs a little bit more fluffier and more natural i get a lot of compliments on my baby hairs now <laughs> and w one thing that i like to do is add the mousse into the hairline as well so see how i add mousse onto the hairline and not just the baby hairs I like to add that just so um, it forms the whole entire perimeter and it makes my hair look a little bit more flatter instead of um, it looking very like I'm wearing a helmet. The mousse can definitely help lay your unit as flat as possible in the front. And don't be afraid to add extra, you know, mousse. And then I actually use the comb part. I don't use the brush part at all. I use the brush part once the um, hair is dried under the hair wraps. But I'm actually very happy with the result of my baby hairs. It's been two months, but I still got it, girl. You still got it, okay? It's definitely in my subconscious. And then here I'm going to add these wraps. And I actually let these wraps sit on my head for over an hour. I ended up like cleaning up the house after this. And um, I just waited until completely dry. So even though it looks like it's quick, this actually took me um, a few hours to do. And as you can see, I'm going to recomb my baby hairs. And look at how fluffy it becomes. It's so gorgeous. Okay. Bomb. Bomb, bomb, bomb. I'm obsessed. I really like this hair. I would definitely want to keep this unit forever, but you know, Reese wigs. I already have someone asking for this wig already, but this is basically it. Thank you so much, Unis Hair Company, for letting me try out this unit, and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share down below, and I'll see you babes next time. Bye. Don't take it personal, I ain't lying. I ain't hiding, I've been grinding. Multiplying, I've been trying to get my weight up, staying prayed up, meditating and taking time away.